Clearing the decks, unlocking the secrets of this idiomatic expression. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of idiomatic expressions, focusing on to clear the decks. Understanding idioms like this one is crucial for mastering the nuances of the English language, as they enrich your vocabulary and help you sound more like a native speaker. So, let's clear the decks and get started on today's topic. The phrase, to clear the decks, originates from a nautical practice. In preparation for battle, sailors would clear the decks of their ships by removing or securing all loose items. This was done to prevent injuries or obstacles during the fight and to make space for the sailors to move freely and efficiently. The literal action of making the decks empty and ready for action is where our idiomatic expression finds its roots. In everyday English, to clear the decks is used figuratively to mean preparing for an important task by removing all distractions or completing all preliminary work. It's about creating a clean slate, ensuring that nothing hinders the task at hand. This could apply to preparing for a big project at work, tidying up your house before starting a new hobby, or even mentally preparing yourself for a challenge by resolving any lingering issues. Let's see how this phrase can be used in different contexts. I need to clear the decks at work before going on vacation. This means completing all pending tasks to have a worry-free break. Let's clear the decks by finishing our homework before we watch a movie. Here, it's about removing the obstacle of unfinished homework to enjoy leisure time fully. The team cleared the decks for the new project by organizing their workspace. This shows the preparation for a new project by organizing the environment for optimal efficiency. When using, to clear the decks, it's important to remember that it implies thorough preparation or cleanup before starting something significant. It's a versatile expression that can be used in professional, academic, and personal contexts. However, it's best suited for situations where a significant degree of preparation or clearing away is necessary. And that's a wrap on, to clear the decks. We hope this exploration helps you understand and use this idiomatic expression with confidence. Idioms like these add color and depth to our language, making your English more vibrant and expressive. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to clear the decks for more learning adventures with us. See you in the next video.